Hello brothers and sisters of the interweb, Steel Phoenix here, and get out your biology textbooks, because today we're talking about the giant amoeba from the Metro series. The giant amoeba are probably the easiest creatures to describe, being little more than a sphere of color-changing cytoplasm with a nucleus in the middle. They spawn from a growth on walls called pores and slide toward their target before self-destructing into a cloud of toxic gas. This, along with their home being D6, leads to the speculation that they may have actually been biological weapons before they were left to their own devices and spread throughout D6. There's also a possibility that the poor may be the actual creature and the amoeba merely a defense mechanism due to the amoeba themselves having no sense of self-preservation. There's also possibility the pores are a hive mind extension or offspring of the biomass, which is a giant fleshy mass that has grown on top of the reactor in D6, seemingly taking energy from the reactor, leading it to violently defend the reactor and stop Artium uh, from lifting the power cells, since it's where it gets all of its energy. Though as soon as all the cells are lifted, the biomass simply stops, seemingly petrified, though apparently not dead, since Miller mentions finishing it off after they finish their mission. With the Dark Ones, the biomass also shows up in the novel, though it resides underneath the Kremlin instead, and has psychic abilities that allow it to attract victims to it for it to consume. It is believed it is the reason that viewing the star on top of the Kremlin causes stalkers to desire to travel there and feed themselves to it. Artyom and his group only manage to escape by throwing a flamethrower canister at it and igniting it, with the resulting explosion causing it to retreat, and that's all that's really known about both creatures since they only appear in 2033. Though it is at least supposedly mentioned in Artyom's journals in The Last Light in Red Square, though the lack of any influence on Artyom as he navigates Red Square shows that the creature was burned out before Last Light, the same notes also suggest it is a result of chemical or bioweapons. It is unlikely that the amoebas or the biomass will show up in Exodus since most areas shown thus far have been rural or semi-rural areas, and they have only been seen in D6, but who knows. They or something similar may make a surprise appearance in Exodus anyway. Either way, thank you all so much for watching. Like if you liked. Subscribe. Uh, to become part of the Phoenix Brotherhood, and as usual, thank you, have a nice day, and this is Steel Phoenix signing off. Bye!